Hello and welcome to Trace Tainment. In today's video, you guys will not believe what happened and what had took place. So Biden had placed a MAGA hat on his head. Yes, you heard that right. He placed a MAGA hat on his head. Now, I'm not sure why he did that or what his reasoning may be, but he had to have known with placing that hat on his head that the cameras were on and people knew what he was doing. He had to have known. But check out the White House. Try to fix this. Um, what we saw yesterday with the president briefly wearing a MAGA hat, since the pool wasn't in the room for that, can you share a little bit more about how that happened and just what kind of message you think it sent? So a couple of things for, for those, like you said, the pool was not in the room, so I just want to make sure I, I lay this out uh, so folks uh, get the context of, of what happened. So we were, uh, the president was in Shanksville uh, Fire Station, uh, one of the locations, obviously, of, um, of where the plane was taken down on September 11th of 2000, uh, 2001. So the president gave an impromptu remarks um, about bipartisan unity. That's what he was talking about. Uh, and... And he talked about it in the moment of September 11th. Was, that's what we experienced after 9-11. And, and said that we needed to go back to that bipartisan unity as a country. And so he made those remarks, impromptu remarks, um, to uh, some of the folks who were there on that day. And he offered a, a presidential hat uh, to a man who was wearing a Trump cap. He was wearing a Trump hat, and he offered it to him as a gesture. And in return, the man said uh, that uh, in the same spirit, uh, the president should put on his Trump cap. And so the president did very briefly. Uh, and that's what happened. It was, it was truly a back and forth about unity uh, and the president remembering a moment in time uh, after a horrific incident on that day and how the country did come together. It didn't, rev it didn't matter what political party you were part of. It didn't matter. We came together as a country because we lost so many souls, thousands of souls, more than 2,000 that day. That's what you saw. As you guys can see, the White House tried to fix it, but it's something that already happened. And I never thought that I would see a day that Biden put on a MAGA hat. Like, that is something that I never thought I would see. And to see it actually happen, it literally... It shocked me. Like, I was like, what is that for real? Like, I thought it was an edited image. And then I look at it again, and I'm like, no, it's not. Like, that actually happened. I don't know. Biden may be thinking of something that, you know, we're not thinking about. He There's something might be playing in his head that we don't know about. But for me, I feel like for him putting on that hat, there has to be some deep reasoning onto why he put on that hat. Because he had to have known that people were watching, obviously people are watching, that people were recording, taking pictures, and he literally placed a MAGA hat on his head. Now, Trump said something during the debate about, you know, giving Kamala Harris a MAGA hat, and to see that Biden placed a MAGA hat on his head completely blew me, blew me away. Like, that's something that I never thought I would see. But the White House tried to do everything they can to fix it, but at the end of the day, it happened. Let me know what you guys think about today's video in the comment section. That'll be a wrap for today's video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care.